Here we go as another one of my videos around um, Mersey Made Studios. Um, this just shows you a little bit about what we're doing to keep ourselves safe and you when you come and shop here. Um, this is my the door to my entrance. Um, when you come up the stairs there, you'll be faced with some arrows to help you which which way to go. Um, and then to your left is our kitchen, that's our kitchen, not public. And then there's plenty of arrows to show you to go around. But when you turn to the right, you'll see my studio, like I say. Uh, and that banner does show you that you are very, very welcome. But unfortunately, my studio is not really suitable for us to be socially distanced. So I've just got that banner across the doorway at the moment. So we can still have a good old chat, um, but I'm afraid coming into my studio will be a little bit tricky unless I corner myself right on the chair over there it's a very pretty patchwork chair but um, for general safety I thought um, we'd put that there and then some of my items for sale there and you can either buy that crossroads quilt or you can indeed make it and when you ask about the kits I will show you up to that sign there um, which shows you what's included in the kit uh, and that's also online on my shop but anyway that's my stand full of goodies you can have a look at and buy um, then you keep going around following the arrows and then we've got Sophie's studio there on the re left and then Jenny's is over here it's first thing in the morning, so nobody here. And then Sean, Paws and Hounds, and then Sean Webster, Illustration Art. And then Jessica Slack Studios, and then we've got an empty one, which I think we're gonna have a student in, uh, fingers crossed. And then uh, Gladys and Gertie over there. And then we've got our new lady, Nikki, does lino drawings and things. And then an empty studio there. But what I want to show you is that we've tried to set out the tables and chairs um, to try and keep plenty of opportunities for you to distance yourself while you have a coffee, something to eat as of tomorrow, not today. This will be as of tomorrow. Um, and the chairs we put well apart so you can sit with the person um, that you know, but you can keep distance from everybody else. And then again, the arrows will show you the way to go round this way, it's a one-way system. You go down these steps and then up the other ones. I'll quickly do that now while it's quiet. Hopefully there won't be that many people around. And those are everywhere. So you just wait there if, the, if you need to wait for people to pass. Um, and lots of welcome back signs because you are indeed welcome back. Um, and then there's the menus that are everywhere so you don't have to wait at this queue and then there's just the two cafe tables that will be used as of tomorrow and then some the shop items are over there and then there's the um, stand with this got the cleat you might not be able to see them but there are actually the acrylic um, stands there to protect staff and you and then you keep going round. There's the lift that you can ask for if you need to use that. And then you come round and we've just got a couple more tables in the main shop area as well. Again, nicely spread out apart so that um, you can eat um, and not feel uncomfortable that you will be socially distanced. And then again, more arrows and signs all over the place. And then you'll go up to the main till, which also has one of those acrylic covers over it as well. You can't see it from here because they are invisible. But, uh, and Jenny and Kristen everybody's busy getting everything ready. And then this is the stairs that I started with. And you go up these and round and round we go again. So there you go. We're doing lots of uh, efforts to make it safe and exciting and enjoyable when you come up to Mersey Maid. So, get on down here. We need you. <laughs> okay. Have a good day, everybody. And uh, we will hopefully see you later.